is. It's Mrs. Camouflage. She's got a new coat on there. Look at that little dinosaur coat. A little style in there. A little big styling star. Baby the dog. Baby the dog. Let's see you doing a little doggy dance for daddy. No? Oh, you want to go to work? Huh? What are you crying about? You want to go to work? All right, come on, push on over there and we'll go to work. Come on, let's go. Some of us guys work, you know. Well, we don't want to all live down in Mama's basement. Oh, what is it? Oh, you crying? Guys, I gotta change this dishwasher here, so. So, I just gotta shut the power off. Oh, this thing's labeled. Number eight. That should do it. Alright, it's off. The problem with this thing is, this thing's not. After it's done washing, it don't dry. It stays wet in there. You gotta open the door to, to let all the moisture out. So, it's a problem with it. I'm just gonna put a different dishwasher in there. Not even gonna play with it. It's a whirlpool. It's not that old. But it's never really worked since day one. Um, when it's done, it stays damp in there. You gotta open the door to let all let it dry. I tried all kinds of settings and stuff, and it's still. Still screwed up. The water's here. Might have to run a new line. I'm not sure on that. The water line yet. Maybe. I'll shut it off there. The drain goes on the top of the garbage disposal, so it's going to be disconnected there. screws up underneath there, hold it up underneath there, you can see it, I gotta take that one off, and that one off, disconnect underneath and it'll slide right out. You can see this is holes by compression, I'm gonna do a disconnect it here. Pliers. We'll have to disconnect the wire until it should be off. Quarter inch. Yeah, it's quarter inch in that way. And then my wrench all the way in. Oh, well, Steve is working again, Mama. Steve is working again, Mama. Next level. Gonna be next level. I said the power was off, so I'm not too worried about it. It's the white. The black. And it is off. This dishwasher's going into the dump anyway, so I'm not too worried about it. Mm. 
Alright, that should come right out now. Slide right out. I know that this countertop is really, really low, so I'm going to have to take the wheels off the other one um, for it to fit. It's really tight, so I know that. All part of the game, Mama. Oh, yeah. Mama. All right, guys, so the drain connection's here. I'm going to put that in there and I'll put that clamp on there and I'll go out the back. Come out the back. There we go with the be able to slide this thing in here. Give me the hard part sliding it in. Trying to get this tucked in there and all that and put the holes in at the same time. It'll be a little tricky. Alright guys on this here I was able to pull it out put the uh, wiring together then it slides back in I'm put this cover back on there but that's how it works like that there's one screw that goes here after I put it back in not easy mama not easy mama. shot on this guy well, do the best I can for you but man it's uh not easy well, this tightens up on here it's really a tight one I had to take um, all the wheels off and stuff to make it fit it was really tight Okay, so that's all tied back in. The water's back on here. I'll turn the water on, make sure I got no leaks, but I should be good. I might have to tighten this up. I'm not sure yet. Underneath the handle had two, two little set screws with the Allen key. I came with an Allen key for the handle. And uh, I had to put the screws in. I had to cut it, cut them, them probes a little bit because they were sticking out. She's not bad. She should work pretty good. It's a tight one, man. It's only like, I think, 33, 33 and a half inches from the floor to the base here. And uh, I, I had to jack it up, even put a, put a nut under the yeah, just to fit it in there. It's really tight. It'll be okay. It's a Maytag. We'll see. Should be all right now. Turn on. I gotta hook up the drain yet. All right, guys. I got the water back on. I got the drain hooked in up top there into the garbage disposal, and I got it looped up underneath. Oh, you can see I got it looped up underneath. You wanted to get it up, get it up high, and then back down. That's what you want. You can see it's way up there, so in the back. That's it, looped up. That's good. I got the water back on. I don't see no drips. Let me turn the power on and we'll give it a chooch. We'll give it a chooch, mama. You want to make sure this is lined up good this way, too. So let's get some. Uh... Let me check it out. Power. Stayed on. It's a good sign.
think this one's got a cancel button too. Yeah, cancel and drain. So once it's full, I'll cancel it. Make sure that there's no leaks. Oh, it's good to check. Make sure that there's no there's no leaks before you put it back together. I had to pull some insulation on it to make this baby fit. But man, she's tight. She's tighter than two coats of paint, Mama. Oh yeah, she is. Tighter than two coats of paint, Mama. Ooh, got a little blue light on it. Kind of, kind of cool. Doing a chooch, he's choochin'. Ain't seen no leaks. You push cancel and, and dump it. Alright, see cancel. That should dump the load. Yeah, you can have it draining there, have it. Just want to make sure we got no leaks, you know. Yeah, that's good. I don't see any leaks. That's good. We want to do a cycle and make sure it works good, but I just wanted to do that. Obviously, you know, once this all goes in, it'll be a lot quieter. See, this thing is a tight, tight fit, man. Wow. But, we'll get it. Pretty much bottomed right out on the floor to get that thing in there, mama. Oh, yeah. She's bottomed right out. There it is. Man, a tight, tight fit guy. A real tight fit. What? I mean, the thing's the thing's bottomed right out. This thing was. I had to get a special dishwasher to be able to fit in here. The room was limited. Alright, we're ready to rock and roll it now. Oh my god, this time. We'll give it a we'll give it a full chooch. I wanna go through a cycle and it'll be fine now.